Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to London, England. And welcome to Brown Control. Chapter one. Hello, everyone. I am Antoine Benton, and I am back here in London, England, after calling a great show for BMW. And look what we have here an important matchup for the Ground Control British Heavyweight Championship. One of these men will be the first ever Ground Control British Heavyweight Champion. Will it be Chris Russell? Will it be Lennon Walsh? Let's get right into it. Here we go. The crowd is lively here tonight. I can't wait for this match to start because this is a special match. This is an important match. As I said before, this is for the Ground Control British Heavyweight Championship. And here comes challenger number one, Lennon Walsh. Lennon Walsh. Excuse me. Lennon Walsh for the past couple of weeks, past month. He's been everywhere. He's been in BWN's Warfare in a classic matchup. Go watch that. He advanced into the Commonwealth Championship Tournament. I get beating Jay Turner with the assist of Everett Costanelli. And now he is here to try to become the first ever Raw Control. British heavyweight champion, but he has a big task ahead of him because he's going up against the big man. He's going up against the king of British strong style wrestling, Chris Russell, here tonight. And we're waiting for his opponent here. And who is that on the stage? Who is that coming out? Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, no. Every Constanelli is out here. What is he doing out here? What's his business out here? My name is Everett Marcus Anthony Constanelli. And tonight I introduce to you one of my newest clients. The king of modern British strong style. And the man that will lead his family to greatness under my name. This is Chris Russell. Lights go out. Every Costanelli just called out. Just introduced. Not called out. Chris Russell. You mean tell me Chris Russell is with that snake Everett Costanelli? The BMW owner is with Everett Costanelli? This is surprising to me, folks. I'm as as much as surprising to you. And here comes Chris Russell with the British Pure Wrestling Championship around his waist. That and for uh for everyone that's wondering, that belt is not on the line here in this matchup. Only the British Heavyweight Championship is on the line. Chris Russell is looking to make it belt number two here tonight. I, I still can't believe he's, he's, he's walking out with Everett Costanelli out of all people. Chris has some explaining to do. Come BMW, chapter two, and, and here it is, the ground control, British heavyweight championship, Lennon Walsh, Chris Russell. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. We are here live in London, England. This is for the British heavyweight championship. Lennon Walsh versus Chris Russell. You can see talking trash here and tell him, give me your best shot. Bounces off the ropes and a clothesline. And he does not go down. He just staggered him. But he does not go down. He tells him to bring, give it to me more. Oh, another clothesline. And he still does not go down. And he's telling him to give me another one. 
We said this time we going down. Oh, but look at this. Chris Russell. Oh, look at this. Nice, nice combinations here. Oh, what a kick. And he does not go down. Chris Russell is a tank. Bossing all the ropes. Oh, look at this. Oh, elbows by Lenny Walsh to get out of that. I think it was an exploded over oh, the elbow. He does not go down. I don't know. A clothesline this time. Low kicks. I think that's what you got to do. Go after the legs here. Oh, and a kick right to the knee. Lenny Walsh now. Bossing off the ropes. Oh, super kick. Bossing off the ropes once again. Oh, trying to go for something and misses. Chris Russell kicks him right in the gut. Can you go? No. Gets out of it and right into an arm drag by Lennon Walsh. Lennon Walsh is looking to become the British Heavyweight Champion here and looking to become the Commonwealth Champion at BMW. Go behind by. No. Trying to go for German. Oh, trying to go. No. Misses. Trying to pick him up here. Oh, throws him. Throws him off and bounce him off the ropes. Oh, trying to go for another clothesline, and he does not go down. Oh, he gets him down that time. Gets him over the top rope. But wait a minute. And he just drags him out. It was all for nothing because Chris Russell landed on his feet, and now he has him on the outside. And... Oh, my God. Chris Russell just slammed him. Just ran him on that guardrail. Look at Eric Costellelli. Just excited about this. As you know, that, oh, German suplex. As you know, Eric Costellelli was the one that helped Lenny Walsh along with that behemoth. Oh! Going for the cover one. Two and no, you two. Every Costanelli, along with that big behemoth bodyguard of his, helped Lenny Walsh to get that match, to win that match against Jay Turner in the first in the quarterfinals of the Commonwealth Championship Tournament. Uh oh, oh, trying to go for a frying pan chop, but he blocks it, kicks him right in the gut, another kick right to the gut, and now look at this repeated kicks by Lenny Walsh. Oh, look at this nice reversal there by Chris Wall. Chris Russell. Oh, what a chop. I tell you, you don't want Chris Russell to chop you. And now look at this, this stomping on the chest of Lennon Walsh. And Chris Russell in control of this matchup. Oh, look at this. Don't tell me the oh my god. The sign of disrespected Everett Costanelli is loving every single minute of it. And this is the man, along with his bodyguard who helped Lennon Walsh get the win in his quarterfinal match in BMW chapter one. And look at the look at the bruise on the chest after that chop. And a hammer throw. Oh. And another hammer throw. Oh man. Trying to go for a German suplex, but Lennon Walsh blocking it. Oh, elbow right to the jaw. Oh, look at this. He's got him. He's got his calf. And he just bent it back on the calf here. He has the calf lock on. Lennon Walsh. Eric Costanelli not liking it. He's, he's wincing along with Chris Russell here. And now oh, what a big time elbow, though. Just a break free of that submission hole. Oh, what a punch by Lennon Walsh. A kick. Another kick, and another, and now Lenny Walsh in control with these kicks. Leaps over to the air for springboard, and a clothesline by Lennon Walsh. And look at this, Eric Costanelli, distracting Lennon Walsh now. What is this deal? I mean, he helped him win the match. You might as well say he helped him. I know he doesn't like Jay Turner, but he, you might as well say he helped Little Walsh win. What's this? Oh, oh, he grabbed him. Oh, my God. Grabbed him out of the moonsault to a power slam. Two and not only a two. Only a two. And speaking of which, what does this say about Chris Russell, him walking out with Everett Costanelli? I mean, what's going on there? 
as the Dragon Sleeper being applied by Chris Russell and Little Walsh breaking free with a couple of knees. And oh, the slap right across the face. He didn't like that one. He slapped him back. A big slap by Chris Russell. He's telling him to come on. Oh, another slap and another one. Oh, a big time drop kick there by the big man. And now look at this. Surfboard stretch by Chris Russell. He's more than just a hard hitting heavyweight. He can go on the ground as well. Technical wrestling. England, home of some of the best wrestlers. Scott Barnett, Alex Strider, J.P. Bastards, Jay Williams. The list goes on and on. Oh, the clothesline. Oh, the running knee. Right in the nose of Lennon Walsh. And I like rolls outside the rig. And look at this. He's slowly taking his time. He's outside. Kicks him right in the gut. Oh, no. What does he have in mind here? But look at this, Lenny Walsh fighting out of whatever he was about to do. Oh, oh trying to hit him in the way I exploded, but look, no, no, oh my! Just flipped him. I did like one arm double underhooks, a uh, uh, single underhook suplex on the floor, and now he has the time to rattle the cage of the fans here, the British wrestling fans. And look at that. Look at that bruise on the chest. Oh, I knee right to the stomach. And again, goes outside of the ring. Chris Russell having his way with Lennon Walsh. Taking his time. Kicks him right in the gut. Double on his suplex. No, trying to gain arm drag. Arm drag by Lennon Walsh. Lennon Walsh telling Chris Russell to get up. Chris Russell slowly getting back up. Eyes glazed over. Oh, look at the, look at the strength. Oh, my God, that's total. On the big man on the outside. And that took everything he had to get that man up and hit him with the exploder on the outside. And Everett Costanelli is over there. What is he doing with Lennon Walsh while Chris Russell is on the floor? Everett Costanelli now. And now look at this, he's trying to, is he reasoning with Little Walsh? Basically telling him, this is a four-round conclusion, you can't win this match. And Little Walsh is having none of it. Chris Russell slowly getting back up on his feet. Oh, but wait a minute. Triangle jump, oh! Sit hard on the Chris Russell. Flip sit hard on the Chris Russell. Going up the top rope. Chris Russell slowly getting back up here. What the? Bruise on the chest. Oh, crossbody. Cover. One. Two. No. Match continues. And let him watch and tell himself, what does he have to do to put this man away? What does he have to do? Side headlock here by Leonard Walsh. Slowing it down here. Oh, punch right to the forehead of Chris Russell. Usually Leonard Walsh is one to speeding up the pace. And Chris Russell slowing it down. And now Leonard Walsh has him. He's slowing down the pace. Having Chris Russell in the side headlock here. As I said before, this is an important match for the ground control. British Heavyweight Championship, what a chop! An overhand chop by Chris Russell on a knife edge by Lennon Walsh on a European uppercut. Oh, he's telling the cover on a chop. And another chop. And another. And oh, oh my gosh! Down goes Lennon. Down goes Lennon. And Lenny Walsh slowly but surely getting back up on his feet after that huge European uppercut by Chris Russell. He's telling him to come on. Give me your best shot. Oh, what a chop. Oh, my God. 
Did you hear that? Chop right across the chest and puts down, let it wash, and let it not give it up. Getting up on his feet all with a chop. And a, oh, another. Oh, my gosh. Let it off. Getting his butt whipped here, but he's still in this matchup. He grabs him. Oh, my goodness, the strength. Freak of nature is Chris Russell. Now look at this. He grabs a nice clubbing on the other side of the chest. And you can see a bruise developing on the other side of the chest there. Chris Russell showing no mercy, no regard. His only focus is to win the British Heavyweight Championship of ground control. And all he has done is this. And look at, look at his chest now. It's just beat red. All thanks to Chris Russell. And Chris telling him to get in the ring. But he is not chasing him. He is not going after him. He is taking his time here. And let it wash. It's just slowly getting back up. But man, he just taking a beating, but Lennon wants to become champion. Let it wash back inside the ring. Well see, he's talking his trash. You can see the chest. Oh, kick right in the gut. Chest beat red. Out of those clubby blows. And uh oh. Oh, 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 oh my god. Oh my goodness. And Little Walsh back up on his feet. Oh, the chop. And another, he's fighting back. He's trying. European uppercut by Little Walsh to Chris Russell. Just, 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 oh my god, just too much for Little. Even though Little is fighting for his life here, he's fighting to become the British. Heavyweight champion. What can he do to Chris Russell? Chris Russell mainly dominated his matchup, even though Lennon Walsh has been fighting this whole time. But oh my God, oh, he just chopped it right back. He's giving it right to Chris Russell. Kicks him right in the gut. Stumps right on the head. Oh, big one. That's a big one. And he goes down. He is outside. That was a big running elbow. That was. And he goes down to one knee. He is beat up. He is tired. But he got Chris Russell to go down with a strike. I know he slammed him. He just hit him with an exploding on the outside. One. Earlier in this matchup. And now. Oh, he's back inside the rig. He's got him up. All military press. No, DDT! DDT by Lenny Walsh is telling him to get up. Will this be it? Passing off the ropes. Oh my god, he just turns it off. One, two, no, only a two, and Lenny Walsh is still in his matchup. How in the world he is still in his matchup? Chris Russell just took this man's head off with a lariat. Kicks him right in the gut. Oh, try to get him up. He's got him in the power of opposition. But look at this. Little Walsh trying to fight back here. He's trying to fight back. Little Walsh is trying to get out of this position. He is trying. He gets power bombed anyway. Oh, my God. Two. And we have a new ground control British heavyweight champion. And his name is Chris. Russell. Every Costanelli has to be elated about this result. But no more elated than Chris Russell is winning another championship. And here comes the ref trying to award the championship to Chris Russell. They just snatched it out of his hands. There is a new monarchy in ground control wrestling, and his name 
is Chris Wall, Wall, excuse me, Chris Russell. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been Antoine Britton. Thank you for joining us.